What is up guys, Sawchasm here, and today I have an MOAB on the brand new map, Foundation. Now you may have seen my MOAB on the other brand new map, Sanctuary, if you haven't, I'll link that down below in the description, and I'll have an annotation on the screen, but basically, I hopped on, got my Sanctuary MOAB, and then a couple games later I got this, so I was pretty happy with the way I was playing, and you know, the way my team was playing, so I was playing with the team, which made it a little bit easier, but... Yeah, so about this gameplay, I was using the same class setup that I was using, the ACR with the Silencer and Extended Max. Really good class setup. And this is a really important move that I did right here. Really important play. So I got my Specialist Bonus, just got it. I was able to tag that Sniper in the back with Recon Pro, so I was able to see which direction he was facing. And then I was able to come back and take him out, and always knowing exactly where he was, which direction he was facing. So that was a pretty good move. You know, had I not hit him and tagged him with recon pro i probably would have backed away there that would probably have been a gunfight that i did not want to be in but yeah so a little bit on this map foundations pretty good map in my opinion it's pretty big to be honest so i think what you know once they i'm not sure if they added this to ground war already these two maps or they're going to add it in the future but i think that they will be pretty good for ground war just because of their size and just remember this little area that I'm in right now over near the A flag because I do come back here a little later and yeah so pretty much what I like to do similar to you know any new map I like to stay on the outside edges of the map but keep in mind the outside edges of the, this map in particular are really strong because not only are they you know good and safe because it allows you to cover yourself from one direction completely you know it makes sure that enemies can hit you from one whole side which is pretty much half the fight you know making sure that you're in a position that is better than the enemy or you're in a safer position that the than the enemy so um not only do you do that and keep yourself a little bit safer but a lot of the edges of this map are you know like like over here this little metal platform they're kind of higher ground which means that you're going to be able to win the majority of your gunfights when you're shooting like down at an enemy or such uh, because of course if you're on a, a higher elevation and you're shooting down an enemy, it's a lot easier to kill them than it is for an enemy to kill you if they are shooting up at you just because of, you know, that's the way it works. Because of physics. Because the, the bullets, you know, they, they don't reach if they shoot up. Sometimes they fall back down on their head. No, no. It's not because of that. I was just kidding. Please, please don't tell your physics teacher that Sarcasm taught you that because I'm sure they will probably find out who Sarcasm is and try to close my channel but <laughs> this, is not, this is not a physics lesson this is a little bit of call of duty talk so as i was saying stay outside on the edges of the map along those high elevated platforms now you see it come over to the, to the a flag for some reason even though we did have a my team was pushed up into c so they all spawned at a now i, I wanted to be really careful here because they were all spawning here so I was pretty much taking it really slow. Luckily that Pred missile cleared them out and I was able to catch them as they were spawning a bunch of them. But I did get shot from behind so I immediately ran to cover. Now you want to keep in mind sometimes it's better to just completely run away from a gunfight that you can't win. So instead of you know fighting there and possibly being able to win that gunfight I decided to run away and guarantee my survival. Which is what happened there. But yeah so there's my Moab. I just got it and I'm... Um, Pretty much I go on a little bit of a streak right here and then I die eventually. I think I get like a 33 gun streak but I don't want to show it all because it is kind of slow. Basically the spawns flipped a couple times. I did capture a couple flags because my team was losing and I really don't like losing at all. So I pretty much went on a capping spree and capped about three flags in a row. I didn't want to show that because it was kind of long and... I don't know, kind of boring, but yeah, there's my MOIB, and I'll fast forward again a little bit just to show you that we won the game, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video, thanks for watching, if you did, didn't like it, if you hated it, make sure to dislike the video, leave some bad comments, and unsubscribe, so thanks for watching.